In a Christian marriage, God's presence, like the third strand in the braid, holds the husband and the wife together. So here's a, a picture of a braid. And if you look at it, you would almost conclude there, yeah, there are only two strands there. But in order to get a braid, we all know you have to have the three. If you've done braids before, the third one holds it together, but it's kind of the invisible part of this. Now, Paxton said here, in a Christian marriage, God's presence is the thing that holds it together. But I would like to suggest this is true of all marriages. When the two come together, that there's a divine work of God uniting the two to give the marriage the best chance of survival. Where God supernaturally does something with that couple so that it's not just a physical union, it's a, it's a, a spiritual union, it's a, uh, it's a coming together in, in a deep way that somehow God accomplishes.